My name is Stefan Stiller. I'm originally from Germany. I came to Shanghai in 2004. I'm a chef now since more than 35 years. I opened the concept uh, Thai and Table Thai Men in uh, 2016. This was an idea I had already in mind for a long time, like having a small place, limited seats, not too large, and something where the kitchen is open, fully exposed, and where it's also kind of interactive. I think it's important for guests to understand the food, and then chefs can explain better than any, any waiter or any service uh, uh, stuff. I always like cooking and uh, I think it was, a, was an interesting profession. When you work in the kitchen and you work with food, it's a very different um, uh, product to work with. And to turn something simple to a fantastic dish, to something where people are really, really amazed and, and very happy, uh, it's a great experience. If you cook food, you instantly know if people like it or they don't like it. Huh? When the plate comes back and it's empty, okay, they like it. If it's not empty, maybe they don't like it. So it's, you get instant, an instant reward in, in cuisine and in cooking. In the first place, it was a job offer I had. And uh, so I was working for, for some restaurants in the, in the early years. And in 2007, I opened my first own restaurant which I have been running at uh, the Cool Dogs Lomato from 2007 to 2013, a restaurant in a cooking school. But then the location became too expensive. It worked very well, but uh, there are always like periods in, in Shanghai. When I look back to where I come from in, in, in Europe, in Germany, you run restaurants for a decade or longer, 10 years, 15 years, 20 years. In, in Shanghai, it's different. The lifespan of a restaurant is much shorter because people are always want to have something new. When I look back at my first own restaurant, I had like, I would say, 60 to 70 percent foreigners. Now here, I have 90 percent local Chinese guests. I think Shanghai is a, is a very nice mix between old and new, um, between Chinese and also being a little bit international on one side. Uh, it's very fast moving, it's very vibrant, it has a lot of energy, sometimes almost too much and it's, it's, it's taking also a lot of energy out of, out of someone, but um, I, I enjoy being here. I have um, a few um, team members working for me since more than 10 years. They are like a part of my family. When I go to other restaurants in Shanghai, there's always someone who worked with me in the past. I was in Chengdu uh, a couple of um, weeks ago and I was meeting someone who was working with me and he is now a restaurant manager and he was just a waiter. And he came back to me and said, oh, I made him so confident in his job and I gave him all he needed to grow. And now he's a very, very good restaurant manager. So I think this is a great reward. This is um, one of my goals um, in China is also to educate and to develop talent. This is also one of the reasons I'm so much involved into the Bukui's Door, the cooking competition, because I want to support local Chinese chefs. I'm not working seven days a week, but I'm working a, a lot of hours. I don't play golf, I don't uh, play tennis. I, I don't have time for this. So I'm, I enjoy being in the industry and I enjoy being uh, with guests. So far, uh, I'm still young and I'm uh, still planning to move forward with the same pace as the last 35 years. And I don't know how long, but I, I still enjoy it and uh, will still keep on continuing.